trust me, there's some people who are reckless. There's some people who, we've, as a society, we've just become animals in these things. No problem. Ah, flavor. No problem. No get your plain flavor. Welcome, my child. You are not judged here. This is the confession booth. Your story, your secret, your scandal. Unfiltered, unjudged. What's the worst excuse you've used to dump someone? Oh my gosh. Let me try to think. Um, worst excuse. I'm just not nah. The worst excuse. I've always been like a really nice person, generally. But I'm trying to think. Um, I remember there's a guy who always wanted to... I think I dated him for quite a long time. and never even used to kiss him or anything. And I'll tell him that my lips hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you're in a hostage situation. <laughs> Not really. Not really. I was just that girl. I was just that girl. I, I, I don't go in too quickly. <laughs> How long? Two years. <laughs> hey, you never kiss him for two years? Hardly. I think I'll like peck him or whatever. <laughs> yeah. You didn't love this best brother, did oh, you? shame. No, I... Come to think of it, no, I really loved this guy. <laughs> I just wasn't ready. And what's the worst excuse that's been used to, like, to dump you? Mm, I don't know. The worst, my family says, you got kids, I guess. So I can't Shit. date you or whatever. Yeah, I think. Or I think so, yeah. I think that's the only one that I've ever had. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Lanano Zimama Gates, where's this? Our do a run as a chinga mizanas. Never no quiz a data. The company, I know, provide a data. A talk chinga miza, I'm sure of confession booth. I'm back again with a uh, former a uh, Miss Zimbabwe, but I'm just joking. Oh, guys. wow. I'm here with. <laughs> I'm here with uh, Ruby News Bay, and we're about to talk about different stuff. What do you have for me today? Today, in the booth, guys, um, someone says, Hi, booth buddies. I have a confession. My friend's brother's wife and I have an old past, like back in high school past. We recently bumped into each other at some chills hangout. She looked so depressed and alone, and we just started talking, and a light 10-year-ago catch-up. She then narrated how the marriage between them has failed because of how it started, which she claimed was a circumstantial one because the guy forced himself on her, and she fell pregnant and was forced to elope. Over the years, she has tried to leave the marriage and go back home, but the family keeps returning her to her husband. After the long talk, we just started having some fun to just diffuse um, a grim atmosphere. Later on, I drove her home and we then made out in the car. From then, we have been seeing each other and I seem to be falling for her and her the same. But I'm afraid I'm going to be the solidifying reason for her to leave her marriage because the husband is more like a brother to me. So this is her friend's brother's wife. Aish, there's a lot of things that I didn't understand in that whole thing, right? Like when the family keeps returning it to, uh, to her husband. Uh, to her husband. Like, it's like, is it like a DHL package? Right? Like, I don't yo, know how these things happen. Like, I don't you lost know something. How these they, they, there you go. Oof. And, and over the years, it depends on how old this woman is, but she can't keep going back if the marriage is not working out. And also, like, hey, there's a lot of questions that I have because it's like, um, how is a married woman my chills and without so comfortable husband without a hu not even without a husband like well but i'm just saying like come my chills with another guy mm. right no but he says we bumped into each other come my chills okay i mean i'm not i'm not i'm not i'm not i'm not castigating or anything i don't know what she's going through in the marriage mm -hmm. but that do my chills first deal but as i don't do that i don't get that she need marriage young i like mm -hmm. I think I'm not comfortable to comfortable say good as open up about like marriage and whatever to another guy. But 
what I'm saying is like, how do you, how do you open up to another man like that who's not even your husband? And you tell him, start telling him about it. I feel like this guy was actually trapped into this thing. You think he was trapped? Yeah. Trapped? I think it was pre I think this and, lady... And he fell for the trap? Yes. How dumb can he be? You know where I started suspecting that this guy was where? trapped? Uh-huh. When she started saying, yo, marriage, I was forced to elope. And she was trying so hard to convince this guy that the other guy doesn't matter. Or she is genuinely depressed and she's going through so much in this marriage. <laughs> and and she, no, but, but, <laughs> come on, it can't be everybody. Because I'm pretty sure I told her genuinely depressed. I don't relationship. She got pregnant and she didn't want to get pregnant. She was forced to tease it because a lot of people who are in marriages I got to tease it. I was sure because I don't get pregnant. I got to tease it. I got to tease it. I to tease it. You know, I don't tease it, I don't tease it. So, what does she relay? But, from when those are tweeting, I'm going to go, I got a pinna more marriage, I said, I'll go pinna. And now she's depressed. She's just tired. She, it's probably not the guy she wanted to get married to, but now she can't leave. And now she's just out here, Kuma chills, trying to live her life. And she missed this guy. And she remembers him from high school, and she just tells her tells him her sob story. Who knows? That could be that could be what's happening here. You know, remember the other episode, the other time when we, you were you say telling me, Guti, uh, no, no, no. I remember we were having a conversation like off camera when you were like, um, you can't just be with someone. It takes a bit of emotion. You have to be emotionally attached. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, Munu, I have all my chills. I don't know whether it was the yoga master or the shisha. Uh huh. And then she got done in the car. I think I'm a feel I'm on wacky. I think I still feel I'm on Guys, I don't know what sports you guys are playing out there, but yo. No, like, but you don't know what she may be going through because people deal with issues differently. Right. People deal with trauma differently. People deal with anger differently. So you get a man who gets angry. Oh, but I'm bad. Oh, it's in the over the three days, you don't know where you're sleeping. I don't know where someone. I don't go know it all. My chills. I got some good talk. Auntie. That's him dealing with his anger. Or I know when go decide that all right, do I take it? But and scoot out anyway. But in the same house, two change in our bedrooms. Are each other in the same? People deal with things. Yeah, I, I like like I understand that. Like I've I've seen I've seen like um I've seen I've seen relationships where people like to the public they actually act like they're together. They've yeah. been together for like twenty five years, mm-hmm. but you realize they were only married for five years. The rest of the twenty. Varongo coexist, yeah. yeah, Bobo. They just have the 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 boundaries. It was always the girlfriend, yeah, but then, yeah, but they know good is item. Um, so there are two things to this one. It could be this woman is just one of those women who or or her man has been really cheating on her a lot, and she just feels like I'm just tired. And the first guy she sees is a guy she's been with before in high school. Mm-hmm. And she's like, ah, oh, this is a guy I know. So it's not just a random guy that she's met. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, so, so you can tell it's 10 years ago. It's high school. But Kanapampanika chemistry and they had something that happened in high school. Whether they dated only or whether they actually did something together. But and she has a connection. connection as well. We don't condone these things, but these things do happen in our society. So emotional support. You're glowing. You're looking hot, girl. Ah, feeling for the past 10 years my man hasn't even been noticing me but this guy is noticing me it's just something so, so so how how um there's something that you um there's something that you mentioned right mm-hmm. we how then do when you say to ano gona ngach boy kana like you were speaking from your own personal experience so i'm going to relate to ngo boy kana chichi ne cha kubo no, I don't know believe out it's not fun to my relationships. Uh, this is personal from my personal from a book one and a very anger from Jinjaning and Chungo now. I feel like Uka ones with Sisa love language emunuako. Auntie. So you get into a relationship, you know someone loves gifts. Do love language. Love language, Mbaskara Madari, food, gango. 
Ah, love, love wow. <laughs> Gango. <laughs> I don't mind Gango. Mystery tones. Mystery tones. Jean and Gino. Hey, guys, really? But... Wonder feet, Gango. Wonder feet, Gango. Wonder feet, Gango. I feet, Gango. Love language complete. <laughs> but sorry, continue. But then I feel like... It's because we choose not to see what is important to the next person. So, iwewe can I for quality time? And then I deprive you of quality time. It's a gap. But you're not taking cognizance of the love language. So, relationship might not be boring, but you can make a gap. I know people get busy, but to spend time with your human, who you know, could you love language again, quality time? Could spend the time, kuno damari. No. Mari, you know, shan. Listen. Not Mari, you know, shan. Could you like love language? Yes, so could you just time me? Yes, so good. I just don't know that I'm already got a lot of quality time. Not to spend a quality time, ka Taka Gara, Kumbaki, do Chona movie. It was a quality time, yo yo. Auntie, ah, sha. Munema generators. Don't tell me what you mean by when you can as to end out. Zima. Yeah, nothing. It's like that. And you're lying. Yeah, I mean, Munema. That is a big lie. <laughs> so how do we help this guy now? This guy is like this guy is like a brother to me. But I don't know what you got. I uh, no, this guy got. No, no, no. She knocked He was trapped into this. But he was kind of conscious. He got to the And you know, these are things that are actually happening. We are not going to go to our conscious. I just can't zone do. I but we want to do problem. I turn now. You talk to our paper. Conscience, I just shut down. But our paper could self control. Talk to our last time. I'm sure we can control ourselves. You can't say that does you feel it? You got and. You make a conscious decision to do it. In, 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 your, in my life personally, I'm not sure about your life, but in my life personally, um, I've had, I've been in situations where you're like, yo, this, uh, hey, yo, this is so wrong, but it feels so right. You know, like, you're like, oh. yo. <laughs> Wow. So like, the, like you, there are situations where, and the funny thing, right? Like I don't know, like it's human nature or whatever, mm -hmm. but there's always the riskier, and the riskier it is, the more thrilling it is, and mm -hmm. the more like, yo, this is like, let's do it again. It's nice. It's so I wouldn't blame this guy. Mm -hmm. Um, but I, cause all I know is that people live once. Wangu. Maybe the old trust in a marriage or right now, currently, oh, you're wow. the pillar that's holding. I'm being for real. But though. there's so many things like this that are happening, but it's also just because in Nango. Okay, let's say let's say you 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 love your person, right? You mm -hmm. love your person and you're in a relationship, whatever, right? Mm -hmm. In both relationships. And then you really see good four, five, six reports. Wangu maybe one or two. Mm -hmm. And then you find someone who covers that one and makes sure good to deal with them. You know, like you know, like problem. Yeah, you, problem. you know, like most small houses pride themselves in saying that they are actually sustaining a, a lot of marriages out there. No, but then that's a warped thing. Really, you talk with as a society. To be honest, I think we're evolving. No, because you'll never get a hundred percent in anybody. True. In anybody at all, right? That's why you have subsidies. No, you can't. Now you have to panic a compromise gonna find on weight when they self control, man. Like uh it is to I've got a friend of mine, I won't say his name, but he knows himself. Mm -hmm. Very old. He's a very old older, he's older than me. I was asking, I was like, yo, you know, your life is perfect. Whoa. Like I was like, yo, how do you do it, man? Give me my notes, say life. Mm -hmm. He's like, and then he talked, told we talked business, we talked different stuff, and then he's like, and like so, so yo, your family looks perfect, you know, like your your missus. Mm -hmm. Then he's like, I was like, so do you have a girlfriend? I was like, so do you know better all my game? He's like, I'm my in and it is my game, dinner and dinner girlfriend. Is in I've yeah. got my wife at proper. home, and then mm -hmm. I've got my proper girlfriend mm -hmm. who knows that she's the girlfriend. She mm -hmm. doesn't call between these hours and these hours. And when she gets that call, she knows that I need these services and these services and these services. I'm like, okay. But in any for me, 
if you feel like you want to be polygamous, because polygamy is rico, auntie. Iriko. Flavor ya polygamy ino na kapa Rwanda. Kana yangu buda pa na udunro ba mrumi, rui na mrumi. Ya chuo problem. Ah, flavor ya chuo nge. Problem. Nge ya chuo plain flavor. Ya chuo ne problem. Kalemo ne dehe bugano ba muuti. Eh, ya chuo ne problem. Sisi society. Ijo, ijo, ijo. Kuna Rwanda, Rwanda. Kuna ita chichi chichi. Anzi, the forbidden fruit. Ndo ino na kapa the most like. Come on. What have we become? <laughs> what have we become as a people? To be honest, it's so sad. We need to. It's not gonna solve control. So what Blaza what did you say already? Blaza what are the problem? Because when they are not going to do you think Blaza what are the rest? I think the rest. But continue. What do you think he drives? A polo or not? A hybrid Voda feet. I think personally, I think that people live once. Like this. Okay, this is the toxic me talking, guys. I think people live once. If you love someone and you miss the opportunity in high school, if you are grown. Sees the opportunity. Oh wow! Yeah, even though she's married to your brother's best friend. I mean, it's life, ne? It's she's life. Just like that. Like that. How would you feel if that happened to you? What do you mean? How would you feel if that happened to you? What happened to me? If your I wouldn't make anyone elope for, for, for starters. <laughs> no, <laughs> but let's just say it has happened. Your woman is feeling depressed in your relationship. You mean I'll never let that happen to my person? Right. Yeah. That's I'm, I'm, good. A, I'm a very hands on prison partner. But uh, I am partner. still going like, to. Like all my girlfriends out there, can you hear me? Prison and hands on. Oh, wow. All girlfriend. your girlfriends, what? all your girlfriends out there. You see, when a problem. I'm a very hands on lover. But I, no. I, I, I totally understand you. But like at the end of the day, also, so you wanted to just be in this miserable place. Okay, what if you were the person who in the, was in a miserable position? No, I would just, to, first of all, I wouldn't just go around telling people my issues. That's the first thing. All right. That's the first thing. So she, A, she doesn't know how to deal with her issues or whatever. But I'm not going to go around and tell people about what's going on in my life and tell everybody. Because, you know, the majority of the people you're telling your problems, they're either happy you have those problems or they want to find a loophole to see how they can take advantage of your problem. In your personal or, life, like... Have you said something to someone or has on a chango by internet? Uh, exactly. What Stuff what like happened? That. Uh, no, not necessarily. <laughs> I've said something and then it just showed up on the internet. No, no, the internet, but like walking out of I'm like in your circle hey, yo, of no, friends. Okay, I just told this person something in confidence because I wanted probably advice. So I guess I've learned the hard way. So you don't go around telling people everything that's going on in your life. Because another day in July. Yeah, and it's spicy, I'm Eh, and the thing is, it becomes spicier and spicier and spicier when it then comes out and it's a, uh, it's an uh, an accepted norm. Kunzi, it comes out like because But you're like, damn, that just that just took a twist. Like it never even happened like that. So the majority of people you're telling your problems, to be honest, they don't even give a crap about it. So don't be going around and telling people, oh, and doesn't guys go and doesn't guys so, and um, we always get advice. Don't tell people about what's going on in a relationship. She 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 she. Where she's telling another man about what's going on in a relationship. Of course, he's gonna want some as well or whatever. So it's stuff like that that she should have also like taken cognizance of. You don't go around telling your relationship problems to any guy that you come across, even if you're that close to each other, because now they're gonna feel like, oh, but Inini, I'm a guy who doesn't do this so if i am like this to her because she's in a vulnerable space so this is what i'm gonna do so he might you might say he was trapped but he also took advantage of the situation that she's in because she also decided to tell her business to the next tom who just came by you know so don't talk to people all the time they don't care they're gonna take advantage of you and he has taken advantage of her but now he doesn't realize that this is what he has done. And now they feel like, and now he's feeling like he wants to keep going back. And now she feels like she is covering a gap. So she's like, I listen, I want someone who can wait. Because I don't rebound. Because, you know. You know, like the, the complex part about this thing, right? Is that the way this woman seems to be emotionally invested in this. Mm-hmm. If this guy then says, you know what, what we're doing is wrong, I think we should stop. Mm -hmm. I've seen hurt women before. She can go to the guy and say, no, that already face we are softer. You know, like, I've, because there's one thing I've observed. Mm -hmm. 
pama video anenge achiroa vanhu vachidza anda muona ane mukadzi wangu chi I've noticed and I've also come to the conclusion that I feel like most of the times that boys are going out on Zion Indre single. Mm-hmm. Cuz there's no way I'm trying to go to your spot or to be like reckless if I know that we're do on the down low. No, but there's some people trust me, there's some people who are reckless. There's some people who panenjikudzo zvoni we as a society we've just become animals in these things because unoona munhu anotozeya kuti munhu uyu ane murume wake. And when you go to a museum, you must remember what. Is it? Is it? Did you get the the animal the animal reference from the from the from the, from the bush? Time in the bush. I think so. <laughs> right. <laughs> Because I see how animals act. Do you know what? Or on a shumba inenge ich netsa na ne. You know, but you know what? I as a society, I'm telling you, we've just become so heartless even because when you go move, when you decide what you eh eh yeah yeah, do you know what? Patur ne moonu, ane ngashi do you know what moonu? Ane numbu ushu. Ane mrumo wake na yemu DM make uri kuita yemu DM make uri kutaura rei naye uchimuti zvone ende uri kuluka hot na sende dumbu rako rakakufita for what reason eh it's social life not here no no i'm not talking about anybody all right okay continue but at the end of the day uri kutochiva mukadzi wemunhu hautozoya kuti mukadzi wemunhu pane vanhu varuzo zvita otodanana nemukadzi wemunhu otona mukadzi wemunhu achitovhuma kuti kutodanana nemumwe munhu iye ane murume wake like those are things that we're not supposed to be doing as a society zviri kuitika but it just shows our lack of self control now and maybe it's because i'm coming from a very spiritual place because i'm like a very spiritual person right. so in everything i do sometimes i think do to others what you want them to do to you So that's how I try to act sometimes. Eh, hey, I don't do things right all the time. I also make a lot of mistakes all the time. But then I look back and I'm like, "Eh, I wouldn't have wanted that done to me." So even when it comes to cheating, I'm like, "Hey, inini ndiga ita find out kuti mfeso wangu wakuita zvandukuita inini izvi. How would I feel?" So at the end of the day, it's more about protecting our feelings and protecting the next person because mental health is an actual thing. And I want to protect my mental health as much as I want to protect your mental health. So my question then becomes good at the end of the day cuz like I mean this person has tried to leave this person already. Mm-hmm. So I mean I think what she's doing is a last resort also would be like yo I'm trying to leave this guy they won't let me leave this guy. That's not the it's best like, resort. It's like I'm I'm being held hostage for what? I don't want cuz clearly this okay from what she's saying mm-hmm. she doesn't want to be in the in the marriage. If so I think she's clearly walked out already on the uh-huh. marriage. So I think right now ango fadza wa bereki ne amazaki. No, but then at the end of the day, um it's sad that you'll have families that treat situations like that where muno a ilopa adzoka ari kukudza kuti hazviskuita. Zvinzi zvitodzokera. But I think the biggest challenge could be she doesn't have anywhere else to go. Um that's the challenge that most women then face in life kuti all right ndatizira handina if she's saying akatizira it means she didn't have a um, very sustainable job she was probably young cuz inenu kanona nda kutizira in my age ah sha ndokono kuti zvanumbu izvezvi ndikazvichinge tira mwana wangu ndikatozvichakira kwekutogara tika and i'll be fine because i'm an independent woman i can i work for myself But we would already find independent in and this is a term you would independent woman yeah you know got a chin fix and at least undo what we have zvakananga ni nyaya independent woman she chine kuti kapa munhu anonzi independent woman no an independent person is munhu wekuti ari kuzviraramira life yake because in my in Tanzania no but rama bill am independent woman kunzo no but then you can have you think you think chero ndi inini ndine mari yakaita say ndi chitoshana chitoana mari yangu ndikawana murume wangu anenge achindo zoti no don't worry i'll pay all the bills because a man i don't i don't do shara just like for restaurant job uno dona ah munhu anga ndiye munhu akaita zvo independent nemajikira ari kuita nema dollar mu pays bank eh amera ringo badara no like the, 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 term indi- the term independence doesn't mean kuti they now don't expect you to pay their uh, bill at oh, the restaurant right. so that means that they are a bit dependent on you right Generally, generally men are supposed to be your providers or whatever antica. But you also find women who actually do pay the bills. They no, are, I hey, I I I, I like some. I, I like I like how um just to sorry to digress a bit. Uh-huh. I like how women 
mm-hmm. are very understanding when it comes to men providing, when it comes to this equality thing. Mm-hmm. It's like they want to be equal about everything, but men just have to provide, you know, like, no, no. No, but then the do you provide. know, like, equality can never really be equality because I'm never going to have a penis, for example. Right. So, yes, equality, equality, and everyone is taking it so practical. Like, anti teaching equality. It's like, you do what men do, you do what women do. You can never go on your period. Like, that will just never happen. All right. Generally. So there's specific, even in roles, there's specific roles that you can say, hey, hey, as a family in the Pinda in Inimu marriage, to have a dirty to create equality. No one that was Juni, Saga, Inini, Trukuti, you went to no watch, and you get a say, and you get a say, and you get a say, yeah, we can read. Total Panama duties, Mumba, Nemurume. That's never going to happen. A man will decide. Like, that's very sweet. Yeah, right. Very sweet men who do that. I'm not talking about watch. 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 But I'm talking about watch. Because I'm not talking about watch. Because I'm not talking about equality, equality. That would never happen. That will really never happen. So we should never take it so practical. equality. Also, you also pay the bill. No, no, like you also go on the period. Like there's some things that the roles that you can't swap at the end of the day. So a man is supposed to provide for me. Women can have their money and I can spoil you. Just like a man uh, can suck the dishes in the house, I can also decide to spoil you and buy you a car. I can decide to spoil you and I'll be the one paying the bill that day. That's just the balance. That's how I take it. No, no, I, I, I hear. I totally hear. So, what he, this guy, um, Inina, I was thinking this guy must cut it off and... Uh, he has to. But he has to cut it off. Difficult. He has to cut it off and... But he might find, face co- uh, conflict in that. Secondly, I'm going to go to the story is still... But first option is to cut it off. It's not healthy. It might end disastrous. It um, will, not it might. Because I know two, three times, you know, she go WWE role. So you might then end up having a child in that situation as well. Mm-hmm. Um, I just think he just needs to walk away from this. I don't think this is his friend's brother or whatever. Yeah. They need to break that friendship. Uh, but I think the most reasonable thing to do is to have an adult conversation with this person and say, listen, where do you see us going? Okay, let's say we pursue this thing. Where are we going? How does this end? What does this entail? Because yeah. you're married. Yeah, she's married. Even though she doesn't want to be in the marriage and she's facing the challenges, and obviously, she ob- obviously has the challenges that she is facing as well. Because can I also point on face with Panic Machines? Ah, I got to item and no, 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 this woman, she's not the one who has looked for us, but if he can give her the advice, Kuti Wangu, I know this is what happened. from she from high school and all that kind of stuff. But this is wrong. If you can't be in this marriage, it's either Kutungo is because he doesn't want to be married to her. He's just to be honest, I don't think he even wants to marry this woman. So why is he being with her and trying to bridge a gap that he knows he can't sustain for the rest of her life? So he should just let that go, understand that he made a mistake, and do the right thing. That's that's all that needs to be done. If we, as a human race, just <sighs> try to do the right thing. Anyway, that's it from better. us uh, at the convention <laughs> booth. Uh, anyway, have um, have an awesome week, and we'll catch you next time. Please like, share, subscribe, comment on all the TikToks and ha- and uh, Instagram and Facebooks and whatever. And yeah, see you next week. And thanks for tuning in. Out. Peace. Was a confession. Go ye, my child, and sin no more.